Today I'm going to show you how to print student login cards for Imagine Learning, which is the new program that we will be implementing this year. The first thing you're going to need to do is open up an internet browser and you're going to type in HTTPS colon forward slash forward slash imagine, oops, I'm sorry, my dot imagine learning dot com. Okay. And you're going to open that. It's going to open, it should open straight to the Imagine Learning portal. You're going to enter your email address, and that will be your school email address. And I have set up a, a demo class, so I will be using a, a demo um, email. And the password. And log in. Okay, once you get into your account, you will see on the left-hand side, Students and Groups. If you will click on that, then across the top you have three tabs. If you will click on Groups, and right here, I only have, um, actually this is my class. You will click on your class and open it. I only have one student, but you will have more than one. But if you will click on the little box above the first student's name, it will put check marks, marks in every one of your students um, beside their name. Then you will click on Actions and then Print Login Cards. And when I pr click Print Login Cards, it, it brings this page up. And if I do Control P, it will go to the printer and I can actually choose the printer and it will print little cards like this and, and you can just um, cut them apart and have them give them to the students or have them in the room depending on the grade level um, that your students are in. And that way the students can learn their passwords or they, they can log in. And if you don't want to print the cards, you really don't have to the students usernames are their first name last name and their password is a b c d so first name last name a b c d now this one is not set up correctly so i will go in and edit it um actually i'm going to go in and edit it now mm, can't do it from there so if you see something wrong because child's name's printed, um, it, it's not spelled correctly, if you'll click on students and the name, you can go in and change anything you want to. Uh, we do ask that you leave the, the passwords the same and the usernames because we, we're trying to keep it uniform across the district. But I can change that. If maybe the grade level's wrong by any chance, um, you, I, can, I can change that. We did not do student IDs and we enabled the the test so you can um, actually go in and change those things click save at the bottom you can print the card from in here if you're printing only one student card and then you just save but if we keep them the same you you, you really don't need to print the cards but that's your choice if you want to go ahead and print them give them to the students uh, that's up to you i hope you enjoyed the video and there will be more to come thanks and have a great day